go off. Get some controls here. Low chart. You can review paths you've taken, the paths yet to be explored, and what possibilities you've unlocked. Each node sends you points that you can expand. The nature of the game, some nodes and endings will not be counted. Though so public opinion is skeptical, our software instability is unknown. These are all the possible outcomes. Oh my god, there's one, two, three, four. So there's five possible outcomes for him. Six possible outcomes. Holy crap, okay. Is that the way it is? Audio is only available in the main menu. Turn that off because we don't need the controller <laughs> speaking to us. All right. Go. Game still looks amazing for something. I don't want to say old, but you know, it's four or five years old, so. Save it. You survive, little fishy. Find Captain Allen. That's Captain Allen. Captain Allen, my name is Connor. I'm the android sent by Cyberlife. It's firing at everything that moves. It already shot down two of my men. We could easily get it, but they're on the edge of the balcony. If it falls, she falls. Do you know its name? Does it matter? I need information to determine the best approach. Has it experienced an emotional shock recently? Listen, saving that kid is all that matters. So either you deal with this fucking android now, or I'll take care of it. Crap. <laughs> Shoot. Understand what happened, save the hostage at all costs.
Deviant took the gun. Okay, I don't see how that helps us, but it just gave us like a 3% better chance of surviving. Okay, so that was beneficial. <clears throat> You've unlocked a dialogue or action that's often beneficial. Kyle didn't hear any gunshot. So I need to check, continue checking all the rooms here. Damn it, the victim, okay. The cop shot the deviant. Oh, hello. Like we need to get we need to get everything we can. Tasty. Okay, so now we know pretty much everything we know.
Okay, let's do it. Oh. Stay back. Crap. Don't come any closer or I'll jump. No, no, please, I'm begging you. Gain the Deviant's trust and approach slowly. Okay. I'm not going to hurt you. I just want to talk and find a solution. Talk! I don't want to talk! It's too late for that now. It's too late. I know you and Emma were very close. You think she betrayed you, but she's done nothing wrong. She lied to me! I thought she loved me, but I was wrong. She's just like all the other humans. Daniel, no! Listen, I know it's not your fault. These emotions you're feeling are just errors in your software. No, it's not my fault. I never wanted this. I love them, you know? But I was nothing to them. Just a slave to be ordered around. Are you okay, Emma? Please help me. I don't want to die. I don't want to die. Nobody's going to die. Stay calm. Everything's going to be fine. I don't know if we've done enough. I can't stand that noise anymore! <laughs> Tell that helicopter to get out of here! Trust me, Daniel. Let the hostage go, and I promise you, everything will be fine. Oh my God. We might have this. I want everyone to leave! And I want a car. When I'm outside the city, I'll let her go. That's out of the question. You're a machine, you have to oh obey. Oh my God, we just lost 20%. And let the hostage go. I've spent my life taking orders. Now it's my turn to decide. Are you so... We should have compromised. Oh, crap. We had like 90%. I thought we had it. That was successful? Wait, what? Oh my god, crap. So what, his arc is dead already? November 5th, 2038. This is the top of the range household assistant. It cooks 10,000 different Come on, Zoe, let's go. 
Man handles the kids more than this. Elementary school. Good afternoon. Hi. Can I help? Wow. Yes, we're looking for you. Honey, it looks amazing. This is exactly what we need. How much did you say it costs? At the moment, we're doing a special promotion on this entire range at $7,999 with a 48 months interest free credit. And it comes with a two year warranty for parts and labor. Painting, plumbing, gardening, repairs. At night, it switches to surveillance mode. It contacts emergency services if there's a break in or if it detects smoke. Excuse me, how much is that one over there? Oh, so those the things that are like pre owned and returned. But it has many other functions. Come along and I'll show you. There it is. It's a bit difficult getting it back in working order. It was really messed up. What'd you say happened to it again? <clears throat> the car hit it. Stupid accident. Ah, I see. Anyway, it's as good as new now, except that we had to reset it, meaning we had to wipe its memory. I hope you don't mind. That'll be fine. Okay. Did you give it a name? My daughter did. AX400, register your name. Kara. My name is Kara. So different, man. Neat, though. So I remember there's like, I don't know, there's what, like five or six different characters that you actually play as? Or like you get to see like their backgrounds of things? I don't know. But this looks awesome. It looks awesome to this day. We want robots to exist in real life. That uh, shows the dark side of it. Welcome home. Would you like to go oh, we've got another one now. Yes, I think okay. Here. Let me help you. Okay, so we have 106 meters away. Oh, 
All right, let's uh, pick up our paint order. Identification verified. Here is your order number 847. That will be 63.99. Please confirm payment. Payment confirmed. Transaction complete. That's so trippy. Imagine if this was legit, like, I don't know, like, in a way, like, I think that right now what it's portraying is that, yes, there is absolute issues that could happen. But, like, it would actually be kind of cool having, like, your own personal, like, Android. Sound off in the comments. All right, if you guys are watching this on YouTube, would you want your own personal Android? All right, let me know. I think it'd be kind of cool, but I definitely think there's, you know, as we saw at the beginning. Room for error. Guys, check it out. We got one of those tin cans here. Look at this little motherfucker. You steal our jobs, but you can't even stand up. Your bitch ass out. Yeah, waste it. Do it. All right. It's enough. Leave it alone. Let us teach this bastard a lesson. Damage it, I'm gonna have to find you. You can take your job next. Let's see how you like it. Okay. Let's go. Run along. We gotta wait for the bus. Jerks made us miss our bus. Now we're delayed. Alright, Marcus. Marcus taking the bus ride. Oh, we're back with Ara.
You've been gone for two weeks, so the place is a mess. You do the housework, the washing, you cook the meals, and you take care of... God damn it, where the fuck's the brat gone now? Alice! Alice! Oh, there you are. That's Alice. You look after her. Homework, bath, all that crap. Got it? Yes, Todd. Get started down here, then you do upstairs. Hmm. I don't know, they're doing a pretty dang good job of making yeah. you really feel for uh, I'll bring it to the androids. Yeah, same place. You know. Okay. We know nothing. He seems like a very unpleasant person. Those were urgent tasks. What else does this guy have for us? Pushing me. Just pushing. This is w weird. I don't remember doing this. Kind of a cool concept. And you're watching us?
Kara. Yes, Todd. Bring me a cold beer. Right away. start down here. I'll head upstairs. Do what you have to do, but stop bothering me. Oh, this. I feel like we have to check everything, because, like, things are going to be so crucial. Go up the stairs, Kara. Thank you. Ventilate. <laughs> okay, there's still a mess here. I have a feeling like this guy's gonna do some stuff. What is this? What did she find? Watch it. Amazing floor mopping skills. I just want to tidy up your room a little. I only need two minutes. Is that okay, Alice? Okay, so she is scared of us. Why? Seems you like reading.
You've unlocked a dialogue or action often beneficial. Do I even want to know? So like I said right at the beginning there, um, I haven't played the story since it like originally first came out. So I don't remember the story at all. I have like no idea like, where any of this is going. And I know there's like a million, there's like a bunch of possible endings. That's a pretty standard thing with Quantic <clears throat> as a, as a studio. There's one last thing here. Oh, he's got a gun. Often beneficial. Why is a gun beneficial? Oh my god, are we gonna shoot someone? Let's uh, talk to Alice. I'm sure we used to be friends before I was reset. Maybe we can be friends again. Your father said you chose my name. Kara, it's nice. How did you choose it? What about your mother? Will she be home soon? You should tell me about yourself. What you like to do, where you like to go, your favorite foods. That would really help me. Okay, we unlock the box. AW Treasures. So he hurt the android. Okay, so that makes sense. So I guess Kara was like the girl's, Alice's first or like only friend and when he injured her and got her reset basically lost like a friend the longest we've spent with one character so far what are you doing uh, i'm playing playing i know what you're thinking you think your dad's a low life huh fucking loser 
Can't get a job, take care of his family. Don't you think I tried to make things work? But whatever I do, when someone comes along, they just fuck it all up! I know what you think of me. You hate me. You hate me, don't you? Say it! You hate me! Don't you? You know I love you. Seventy one percent completed. Okay, what did we miss? Oh, there was a bunch of stuff on the first floor that we missed. Okay. Still on November 5th. We're back, uh... We're back with Marcus. Marcus! Glad you're liking it, chat. Deposit the package. Oh. Oh, we're gonna let the little birdie out. Oh my god, they're not real. Oh, they're android birds. Oh, that's what... Okay, that's creepy. What's going on, Sharky? Uh, alright, Carl. Wakey-wakey, Carl. Your personal assistant is about to uh, wake you up. Uh, first playthrough? No, I played the game when it originally came out. Like I think it was what four or five years ago the game came out, but so it was kind of just time to to revisit. But I don't remember basically anything of the story. So yeah, it is kind of basically like first playthrough. But yeah. Okay, where the heck did we have to go? Uh, curtains in a window. Uh, I'm gonna assume this door. Oh, dear. I play so many games, man. Like, I don't, uh, there's a lot of things that I forget. Uh. Good morning, Carl. Good morning. It's 10 a.m. The weather is partly cloudy, 54 degrees. 80% humidity with a strong possibility of afternoon showers. It sounds like a good day to spend in bed. <laughs> I did go to pick up the paint that you ordered. Oh, yes, I've forgotten. Okay, so Carl's got some meds. That is the difference between you and me, right, Marcus? You never forget anything. Show me your arm, please, Carl. No. Carl. Thank you. Hmm. I just opened my eyes and I'm already gritting my teeth. Humans are such a fragile machine. They break down so quickly. All this effort to keep them going. Hey. What happened to your clothes? Oh, it's nothing. Just some demonstrators in the street, Carl. What a bunch of idiots. Hmm. They think they can stop progress by roughing up a few androids? I hope they didn't harm you. Oh, no, no. They just pushed me around, Carl. I'm fine. Okay. 
I'll take you to the bathroom now. They've done such a good job of making you really like the androids. Like, I forgot what a great game this story. <laughs> a great story this game has. Oh wait, no, keep walking. Keep walking. Well, that was quick. All right, so we're going to take him to the dining Anything table. Special on the agenda today? Yes, there's the opening of your retrospective at oh, the Museum crap. of Modern Art. Well, turn you Gallery around. Gallery director left four messages asking to confirm your attendance. Hmm. I cannot. <laughs> we'll see about that later. Okay. What else? Just your usual fan mail. I've oh my, answered. Lanta. Hmm. There we go. Finally, we turned. <laughs> Any news from Leo? No, Carl. Sorry. I can call Just him if totally no. running you into the freaking wall. No, don't bother. Uh, how's your weekend going, Shark? Hmm. Uh, welcome, welcome, by the way. Completely forgot. I rooted myself. <laughs> That's the weekend. You can make them a little stiffer, Stop right? Then. Well, your breakfast is ready. Bacon and eggs, just the way you like them. Thank you, Marcus. You're welcome. That's the weekend. You can always make it a little bit stiffer. Right? Unless, of course, you gotta work. Then it's an even better reason to make them a little bit stiffer. I'm a lightweight, not by choice. <laughs> I don't drink, so I mean, I'd 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 a hundred percent be a lightweight. <laughs> okay, that'll do it. He's got a smiley mug. I want a smiley mug. Okay, I have a mug with a smile, like something smiling, but I don't have a smiley mug. Future goals, get a smiley mug. Thank you, Marcus. They're literally just bacon Television. and eggs. Is that all it is? I'm pretty sure that was just bacon and eggs. Funny. Why don't you find something to do while I finish my breakfast? I'm sure. Hmm? Okay, Carl. Breakfast is served. Okay. Uh, find something to do. Um, let's see. We've got three options. Four options. That is a banging TV, though. I just want us to point it out. We could read. Shakespeare... Keats, Odes, what? Okay, Plato. Um, Marcus seems like a Plato type person. What are you reading? Plato's Republic. It's one of the books you recommended. So, what do you think? I quite like philosophy, I think. It asks the questions that I can't answer. You know, what is right or what is wrong, for example. It's not something that is so easy to decide. Asking questions that have no answers is part of being human, Marcus. One day I won't be here to take care of you anymore. You'll have to protect yourself. Make your choices. Decide who you are. 
and want to become. This world doesn't like those who are different, Marcus. Don't let anyone tell you who you should be. Let's go to the studio. Okay, so he just basically was like, hey, you need to be your own person. And... Okay. You need to become human. Pun intended. Uh, where do we take him? Okay, it just does it automatically. Let's see where we left off. Remove the sheep. Oh, that's dope. Oh, I forgot about this. Yeah. Your favorite part of the game? I, I think... I think, yeah, I remember what this is. Like, so you play so many games, it's like you forget what a lot of, uh, like, happens in stories. Plus, there's so many endings to this game, like, I don't even remember the ending I got originally when I played it, so. Hmm. What's left for us? Okay, something over here. Oh. What the hell are those? Wait for new instructions. Okay. Progress. So, what's your verdict, Marcus? Yes, there is something about it. Hmm. Something I can't quite define. I guess I like it. The truth is, I have nothing left to say anymore. Each day that goes by brings me closer to the end. I'm just an old man clinging to his brushes. Carl. But enough about me. Let's see if you have any talent. Oh, we're gonna paint. Give it a try. Try painting something. Paint? But would I... Painting what? Anything you want. Give it a try. <sighs> All right, let's go. Paint ourselves a, a masterpiece. Become the next, I don't know. Paint a statue, paint a desk. Paint Carl's painting. Um, What do you think, chat? Where should we go? Statue. A desk or Carl's painting. What do you guys think? Case is time. I don't know if it's timed or not.
Choose his painting? Okay, let's go with Carl's painting. Oh. Cool, a very interactive game. And I think that's what's um, so unique about it is that it is, um, it's so interactive. What's oh, a person? It's a perfect copy of reality. The painting is not about replicating the world. It's about interpreting, improving on it, showing something you see. Carl, I don't think I can do that. It's not in my program. I... Go on, go, try it. Grab that canvas. Do something for me. Close your eyes. Close your eyes. It's cool how like they Trust know me. they're androids. Like he's like, that's not in my programming. That's really neat. Try to There's like small little details. Exist, something you've never seen. Now concentrate on how it makes you feel. And let your hand drift across the canvas. If I painted with my eyes closed actually it might turn out better than if i was actually looking at it because i can't paint worth a damn uh androids humanity or your identity <sighs> let's go with his identity that sounds interesting androids despair doubts or he's a prisoner Doubt? He's got doubts about humanity? I mean, he's definitely got doubts about humanity, that's for sure. Whether or not they fit. Yeah, oh, it's not tiny, yeah. Yeah, I caught on to that while it was sitting there. Not timed. I don't know if there is a lot of time things in this game. I can't 100% remember if there's actually a lot of timed events in this. Oh Damn God. good. Hey, Dad. Leo. I didn't hear you come in. No, I was in the neighborhood. I thought I'd stop by. It's been a while, right? You all right? You don't look so good. Oh, yeah, yeah, I'm fine. <laughs> hey, listen, uh, I need some cash, Dad. Again? What happened to the money I just gave you? Uh, well... It just goes, you know? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you're on it again, aren't you? No. No, no, I swear, it's not that. No, don't lie to me, Leo. What difference does it make? I just need some cash, that's all. Sorry. The answer's no. What? Why? You know why. Yeah, yeah, I think I do know why. <laughs> you'd, rather, you'd rather take care of your uh, plastic toy here than your own son, right? Tell me, Dad, what's, what's it got that I don't? It's smarter, more obedient, not like me, right? But you know what? This thing is not your son. It's a fucking machine! Leo, that's enough. Enough. You don't care about anything except yourself and your goddamn paintings. You've never loved anyone. You never loved me, Dad. You never loved me. All right, well, that took a turn for the worse. A feeling we haven't uh, we haven't seen the last of him, that's for sure.